Hey YouTube, welcome to my review of the Umarex HNK MP5 KPDW. This is a BB gun, an air gun. Sound off if you love air guns. All right here is a closer look at it. That is the safety there. Safe or ready to fire, your choice. This has a folding stock. To unfold it or fold it, you push it up like I did there. Comes with a 40 round BB magazine for extended fun. You see the sights there. All right, here are a few shots for you. This has what they call their realistic recoil action, blowback action. You see that rail? It does not come with that rail. I added it, right? So accessories like that rail are widely available. I'll include a link to it underneath the video. You can also get extra magazines for it. It comes with one magazine but I have acquired a spare, and again, I will include a link to the extra magazines under the video. This is CO2 powered, so to replace the CO2, you remove that pin and that'll drop down. There's a hinge. And the CO2 goes in the back, like so. All right, and you can just slide it out, and when you're ready, you can put a new one in. So if that was a new one, you put it in like that. And then you have to put that pin back, right? So it's a little bit of a process. And then there's a thing that you turn to pierce the CO2. Right, but you got to get the stock out of the way. And you just turn that to pierce the CO2, get a good seal, and you're ready to go. You're going to get at least two full magazines of shooting from one CO2, right? And you could squeeze out a few more shots, but at least 80 shots per CO2. Right now, the FPS for this is listed as 400 feet per second. We've got a target down there, so I am going to empty a full magazine, hopefully towards the center of this target. Let's see what we can do here. And you will notice the blowback action there. Okay, well, that was a lot of fun. Let's see how we did. You know, you, you realize four, 40 BBs is a lot. You get a lot of fun uh, per magazine. All right, so not so bad, huh? So we completely yellowed out the bullseye, and then I add some to the right. That was my bad, but uh, yeah, the patient was definitely complaining of chest pains. You know, I always ask myself if that was an enemy soldier and, you know, the heart was in the center, would he have, would he be dead? Well, if that was an enemy soldier and assuming this were a real firearm, you know, if his heart was centered on that bullseye, uh, safe to say uh, he would be meeting his maker. So that is the accuracy at close range. I, I'd say not so bad, especially if you do your part. I mean, we whited out or yellowed out the bullseye, right? So I was happy with that, especially since that was only like the first day that I had an opportunity to get out there and try this out uh, on a target. And you saw the distance there, I believe. I believe it was about 20 feet, fairly close range. But, you know, it is a, a smoothbore uh, BB gun. But all in all, a lot of fun. It was even more fun than it looked, and I know it looked pretty fun. I think you all want to get out there now and try this out. All right, final thoughts, pros and cons, what you need to know if you're considering purchasing this. Well, I love the 40 BB magazine. Uh, it gives you a lot of fun shooting before you have to reload. The folding stock and the foregrip, definitely add to the accuracy, help you aim, hold it steady. Many reviewers have mentioned that the sights that it comes with are not the best. And yeah, that is true, but accessories are widely available. And many reviewers I saw uh, had added a red dot or reflex sight to it. 
right? And I am going to add an optic. It just hasn't arrived yet. That's why I have the rail. Now the realistic recoil action does take some of the CO2 to operate that. So you're not going to get as many shots as a non blowback. However, you know, that's just true of every blowback. And the fact is it just adds to the fun factor. Now it does take a little bit extra time to replace the CO2 compared to my other air guns. But overall, I would say this is a winner. The usual price is about $100, but I uh, found mine on sale for $90, and that's when I picked it up. I'll include a link underneath the video if you want to check out the stats or if you want to uh, buy one for yourself. But my final conclusion, definitely worth it. I'm glad I picked it up. 10 out of 10, fun factor. I highly recommend it for casual fun, outdoor fun, recreation, plinking. Oh, heck yeah. All right, I hope you enjoyed the video. This has been We All Juggle Knives and Air Guns. I'm out.